What's up, 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 what's Okay, if you find a reading that doesn't resonate, okay, just leave it right where it's at, okay? It's a lot of you guys, okay, that I'm channeling for. Every time you guys hit that subscribe button, it's an energetic way of me and you guys connecting. Um, Like I said, I'll be just as shocked as you guys when these readings come out, okay? So if you find a reading that doesn't resonate, um, you know, check out my other readings on my channel. All my readings are timeless, Okay. But I'm always going to be obedient and put the message out, okay? Because it could be for someone. Thank you. So let's get into this message. So I see I just had to say that, okay? Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, divine. My ancestors of the highest white light. My spirit guides, my holy angels. Archangel Michael, please come in and protect me and my son sees while I channel the energy for them. Anything other than the highest white light, please close, shut, and block that door. Please and thank you. Holy Spirit, what's the current energy? What is the current energy? What is the energy surrounding the collective sun seeds at this time? What is the most important messages you want them to hear at this time? I had to um, crack this deck and have some seeds because <laughs> this is a big deck. So let's pull from the what's teeth deck, volume two. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, what's going on? Okay, so somebody finds you extraordinary. Somebody feels drawn to you, Sunseeds. Hmm. Somebody is somebody finds you extraordinary. Somebody feels drawn to you, but we have the evil eye here, okay? The evil eye, they put a spell on you. Flings, wild things. Ugh. Yeah, and then we have dot, that hole over there. Okay. And choosing and copying. Who shall? So, someone who feels like you're extraordinary, they feel drawn to you, there's a dot over there, okay? Whoever this karmic is that's shooting you the evil eye, um, that's wishing ill intent on you, that's copying you, who's super basic, I'm hearing. Um, this is someone um, who's trying to cause some type of chaos. Who shall? Somebody could have definitely walked away from this comic, gave up on this comic. Give me a card for extraordinary. Somebody finds you very magnetic. Yeah, admiring you from afar. They can look, but they can't touch. Whoever this person is, they're admiring you from afar. <clears throat> Somebody feels like you theirs. But this person is definitely connected to a dot, a, a karmic in some type of way, who's wishing you the evil eye. What's this evil eye about, Holy Spirit? What's this evil eye about? And this is somebody who they only had a fling. It says flings and wild things. So whoever this fling is, okay, this is uh, whoever this fling is, this dot is, they don't caught feelings for this person, okay? Somebody knows that this person is into you, admiring you from afar, okay? Maybe you guys are, you know, just distant or maybe you guys haven't been, you know, been in contact or haven't been, you know, um, been together for a while, but somebody is still into you. They still into you. They still watch you. Um, I don't know how they're admiring you from afar. If you have social media, that is how. Um, There's somebody who's who's watching you, watching your every move I'm hearing. And whoever this karmic is, is that is that they had a fling with. There's somebody who's wishing you the evil eye that's trying to put a spell on you. Okay, they upset that this person is drawn to you. Yeah, under the bottom, unconditional love. Love without limits, avoidance. So somebody could be avoiding, um, 
somebody could have been avoiding you or this connection. Maybe this person feels like um, you're going to either, you know, cut them off. You don't want to hear from them. Or they may be, uh, somebody could be feeling like they got to, um, you know, they got to give you answers. Thank you, Spirit. They got to give you answers. Yeah, this is somebody who could have definitely abandoned you. Hmm. Yeah, divine feminine here. Divine feminine, controlling. Hmm. A person could have hooked up with a flame or, you know, whoever the thought is. Because they couldn't control you, Divine Feminine. And somebody bitter as hell. Somebody bitter as hell. Mm. What's this evil eye about, Holy Spirit? What's this evil eye about? What's this evil eye about? Crunk? High and crazy? Wow. So somebody gets high and crazy and crunk? Okay, this could be somebody who does a lot of pills or were high and crazy crunk. I mean, that could be anything. Okay, so this is somebody who gets high under the fluence and start wishing, you know, giving, um, wishing you the evil eye, wishing ill intent on you. It says thirst trap. I need attention now. Whoever this comic is that is thirsty as hell, okay, that needs attention because whoever... Whoever your person is, they're not giving them. Obviously, they're not giving them no attention, okay? Because with this extraordinary, this somebody it feels like you you the bomb, okay? <laughs> somebody feels like, okay, they feel drawn to you. Um, like this um magnetic pull towards you. And this is somebody who feels like uh, they can't be close to you now or they can't get next to you right now. So what they do is they're admiring you from afar. Whoever the karmic energy is that they had a fling with, this karmic knows that this person is into you. So, and being that this karmic knows that, they send you the evil eye. This is somebody who they who, who your person could get crunk with. Maybe they both get high together, okay? But wh whoever this karmic is, once they get under the influence, this is somebody who starts wishing you the evil eye, trying to put spells on you, Okay? And none of these spells are working because you're too protected. Somebody is thirsty as hell because they want attention from your person and they just not giving it to them. The only the most they probably got was what's this fling. Okay? That was it. It's giving like somebody who who feels like, because I'm looking at this, it's like a mask, and you know, somebody who be doing wild things in the bed, trying to, you know, you know, put on a best act. But you know, somebody is just like, no, my heart is with Mystic Sunflower Collective Sunsea. That's where my heart is. And whoever this thirst trap is, they want this person's attention. It's like once they finish doing what they're doing, they just set them on their way. <laughs> sure. Yeah. There's somebody who get crunk high and all types of stuff, and they feel some type of way. Yeah. There's somebody who was mad because, um, and it's, okay, I'm also hearing somebody, whoever, somebody that you're not giving attention to is taking it really rough. Mm. What's this flames, Holy Spirit, flames, flames, thank you. Ooh, cult. Strange and sinister. Wow. So whoever this person is that they that be having flings, they're part of a cult. Strange and sinister. This is somebody who's trying to put spells on you, who's wishing you the evil eye. This is somebody who wears a mask. Yeah, love affair. Intense, unlikely, woke, deceitful. Wow. Ooh, child. That's why you got to be careful who you sleep with. You don't know what people be involved in. 
this is somebody who has reckless um type of um reckless type of you know what okay with this a coat and flings and and crunk this somebody who ooh child mm -mm. this somebody who's strategizing loaded deep pockets This somebody who goes out and plot. This somebody who's a smooth talker as well. Somebody, somebody goes out and look for a certain type. This could be also be somebody who pays for something. You know what? What's this a cult? This man or this woman that's a part of this occult, okay, is trying to send you the evil eye because. They don't, because you're not giving your attention to them. Yeah, a cult is clarified with uh, celebrate. I heard celebrity. But it says celebrating quietly. Moons the word. Wow, this is somebody who would be chatting and doing. This is a, let me, PTSD. This could be somebody who suffer suffer from some type of trauma, illness, or or guilt, or um, worry, sadness, depression. Um, some type. Ooh. Somebody has somebody's in a cult and they friends hook them up with people. It's like people go out and party and hang out and they go they go meet up with people and and they date them. Like they date them, they they hook up, they have wild flings. Oh. Yeah. like somebody that's a part of this and they, and they go out and they do all of this stuff um this person is it's just giving like somebody is trying to like numb the pain because they because they because they don't have your attention or they try to numb the pain because you guys are not in you know in communication mm. And this could be whoever this person is that they're having a fling with. They could be all in a cult together. And whoever one of the cult member is, they know that this person is into you. And they're trying to, you know what? Pizza. Ooh. Yeah, this person, there's some type of mental health issue. It's a lot of mood swings with this person. A lot of differences. Mmm. Can I have a card on a celebrating quietly? Thank you. Scare tactics. Celebrating quietly. Somebody could be definitely um scaring them, threatening them. Um, you know, trying to raise some type of fear, spiders. Somebody trying to get um raise some type of um somebody could be threatening to expose someone for something sinister that they have done. Yeah. Mm-hmm. When it comes to like whatever this occult thing is, this group thing is, this wild things they do. Okay. Whew. Somebody is definitely could be threatening to expose someone. Yeah, reject it. Can't sit with us. Somebody is saying if if you if you listen, private investigator. Ooh, listen. Damn, somebody could be feeling trapped. Like they got themselves caught up in a situation and they want to get out of. Maybe somebody wants to come to you, but they can't because they in this. They got themselves caught up in some junk, and all they could do is admire you from afar. That's where the PT, PTSD, the mental health issues, coming from. 
Wow, my light went out. Mm. Yeah. Something is about... Somebody is saying, like, whoever this person is that they're sleeping with, whoever this person is that um, that they could be wanting to pull away from, you know, like I said, whether, you know, there's a cult or there's this thought, this karmic, whatever. Somebody is saying that if you reject us, if you pull your energy back, these skin tactics, I'm going to blow you. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell about these secret parties that we had. Celebrating quietly. It says celebrating quietly. I'm going to tell about these these parties we had. I'm going to tell everybody about these flings we had. Ooh, it's like somebody knows that somebody wants to be with you. Um, and with the mental health issues and the PTSD, they're stressed out because somebody knows that um, what they did behind closed doors. Yeah, and they know that this person is in love with you or want to be with you or, or feel, you know, very drawn to you. That's why they're wishing you the evil eye because they know that this person wants to be with you. Oh, yeah. Private investigator. Somebody could be, somebody could be worried that someone is going to investigate and find out. What's this thirst trap? Somebody is worried about someone finding out the truth about, about them. Thirst trap is clarified with long-term investments. So this could have been somebody. I'm telling you, somebody was paying for something. They was paying. Yeah. Thirst, they was paying. Yeah, scamming deceitful. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Somebody was getting scammed out their money. Mm-hmm. And somebody is saying, if you if you if you go and be with such and such, or if you reject me and leave me out in the cold, okay, I'ma tell them you did this. I'ma tell them you did. It's like somebody is ready to expose all someone's business, all someone's business. I'm hearing whoever this person is, it, it, it they, this person can't even look you in the eye. Somebody got a lot of stuff going on with them. Yeah, financially using you. Somebody is. I'm telling you, they was using this person. Emo, emotionally a drama queen. Yes. Whoever this drama queen that was just using them, they're threatening to expose this person. They know things what this person did in private when they was under the fluence with the crump and celebrating quietly with the Sukkot and flings. Yeah, cancel. No longer, no longer existing. Ooh. So whoever your person is, they want to cancel this person out. They want to dismiss this person. But it's like somebody blackmailing them. Like if you take the money or if you leave or, or, or you, you know, you reject me any type of way. It's like, ooh, child. Oh, peaked already. Their glory days are over. I always get with this car like. Somebody who used to be, you know, used to be real handsome or somebody who used to be very pretty or like, I mean, they could still be, but I always get with this car, like somebody like, I don't, they washed up, I mean, not like, not, I mean, yeah, that's what I get, like washed up, like you ain't that no more, like, you know, when you used to be like that, you ain't that no more. Somebody could be feeling like they got to settle. Yeah. Ooh, in danger to themselves, put in harm's way. Somebody is definitely in danger to themselves. Somebody is going through something. They're going through something that they want to get out of. Yeah, finesse, manipulator or trickster. Somebody, yeah, whoever this person that got finesse, they burnt out. Because they feel, they feel like they, whatever this, this stuff they got themselves into, Somebody is finding out that this this is this is terrible. Yeah, they burned out. Cause whatever this group thing that they was doing, whatever this stuff they was doing with this person, I'm hearing somebody introduces somebody to, to, like somebody put someone on. Somebody has some, some wild ass thing, Sunseeds. Yeah, they burning. And somebody can possibly um possibly endanger um uh, it says endanger to themselves, put it home away. It's time um taking action, finally doing something. What's this burned out? This is messy. 
Let me go hurry up because I don't know what's that. Naive romantically. Mm, inexperienced or overly romantic. Love bomb. Manipulated love portion nine. Ooh. Somebody feel like they got love bomb. Mm-hmm. They feel like they got love bomb. Mm-hmm. This is somebody who, who who's emotionally physical. This is whoever this person is. They be threatening this person. This is somebody who's like they come off one way, but this is somebody who's emotional abuser behind the scenes. It's like somebody wants out of something. This is this person is like, mm -mm. I'm gonna tell everybody what you did. I'm gonna tell everybody what you do. I'm gonna tell everybody what you into. Oh, chair. There's a private investigator. Who's this private investigator? Sitting on a pedestal. Okay. So somebody could be looking into this. Sitting on a pedestal. Who's this a private investigator? Sitting on a... Oh, somebody is worried. Somebody is worried that... they Somebody who put you on a pedestal is worried that you're going to find out the truth about this. A private inve investigator was clarified was sitting on a pedestal. Somebody is worried that you're going to find out the information, the truth about their real life. Yeah. How di different is? Yeah, you're going to find out, you know, how different you guys may be. Um, they could be going through uh, financial blockages with their money. Yeah. Can I have a card on the sitting on the pedestal and private investigator? Unchange, unalter, and live it in the past. Somebody is worried about their past catching up to them. They're worried about you finding out about their past. Yeah. Somebody worried about you seeing them as fate. <clears throat> this somebody who, who, who wants you. Yeah. Somebody, this person wants you. Snatch. They find you extremely hot. Extremely beautiful, sexy. Yeah, this person is strategizing. They want you, but somebody just feel like it says admiring from afar. They can look, but they can't touch. Somebody feels like they can't get close to you because of what they're dealing with. They got something. They they got something on their hands that they trying to get out their life, but somebody is threatening them. Anything else, Holy Spirit? What's this? Um, give me a card on the differences. Differences. Differences is clarified with jealous of your beauty. Whoever this karmic is that's jealous of your beauty, that knows that this person wants to be with you, whew, they're very insecure. And the truth is like, somebody is threatening this person. If you leave me for Mystic Sunflower Collective Sunseeds, if you reject me, okay, there's going to be blockages on your money, okay? They're going to cause all type of stuff. Because this is somebody who wants this person for their investments, for their money, okay? This is somebody who, when they don't get their way, they're emotionally a drama queen, you know? They go off, they start stuff. Yeah, cutting ties, cutting ties expire and discontinue you. Somebody, look, somebody is trying to cut their ties. Yeah, in too deep, no way out. Somebody feels like there's no way out. Yeah, but somebody is definitely going to abandon this situation. They are. For a lot of you guys, they was gaslighting you and abandoned you. Uh, because, but, because there is somebody behind the scenes, okay, that they're dealing with that is, um, I feel like whoever this witch, whoever this dark witch is, they over there doing, doing some numbers on this person. Mm-hmm. And they getting used. They getting manipulated. They get they, they keeping this person to where this person wants to get crunk, okay? So they could be out of their damn mind with this PTSD and, and mental health issues, okay? Uh -uh. Yeah, there's somebody who spends money recklessly and then they play victim and then they come and try to like sleep with this person to get more. There's somebody who's hot and cold. It's like this person wants this person to be like you. Beautiful, inside and out. Loyal. You know, that's what I'm getting. Let me see. 
It's like they want them to... Somebody, this person with this thought, this thirst trap, is like they realize that this person could never be nothing like you. They can't. Maybe they was with, with this peak already. It could have been with this person a long time. Maybe since they, you know, they was younger or when, you know, when this could have been was a time where this person got a lot of attention. They was getting a lot of money. They was successful. And then, you know, they, they was, they was, um, they could have ran into this person, but things have changed for this person. And now that somebody wants to be with the one that they truly love because they, but, but they feel like we're admiring you from the far. They feel like they can't get close to you because whoever this, whatever this coach stuff they got going on, they feel hostage and secret stash. Ooh, child. Yeah. But trade. somebody feel like somebody was keeping them against their will. <laughs> That's not funny. Against their will. Look at this look hostage. Okay. Stashing their bread, taking their money. Well, look at this secret stash. Yeah, somebody feels betrayed. Mm. Somebody found out that this person was looking at you, wanting to be you. Somebody started being real deceitful, scamming this person, trying to get the best of them, you know, to get this person all messed up. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody feels like they got so much going on, the most they could do is admire you from afar. I do feel like this person is is abandoned, is definitely abandoned in this situation and walking away from it. I just feel like this person just got a lot going on. <clears throat> something could definitely be I have something to do with legal issues as well. Anything else, Holy Spirit, as I close this reading out? joyfulness and loyal you this how this person sees you sun seeds you make them very happy you very loyal somebody got themselves caught up in a situation i mean something sinister and strange some strange things and it's like somebody they had it good with you they realize how good they had it with you. Joyfulness and faithfulness. They realize how good they had it with you. You was loyal. You. And it's like somebody was gaslighting you or love bombing you. And they, and they, cause they had a, a whole, the, 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 if you want to know why somebody was love bombing you and gaslighting you, because somebody had like a, a whole nother world, a whole different, it's like a double life. Surprise, enemy, merchant. Yeah. Somebody was su surprised to find out that somebody was stealing from them. Mm-hmm. Stashing their bread. Having secret stashes. Somebody is realizing that this person was an enemy. And now they're in sorrow. Because the one person who they who they find brings them joy, who was loyal, you, they feel like they only could do nothing but watch them from afar because they trying to get themselves caught up, caught um, get out of a situation that's just like it's not it's not healthy. Oh, it's a surprise, an enemy. Thank you. What a wolf. Wrong. Somebody is ooh letter and transformation. Something could be changing. Somebody could even be depending on how much stuff somebody doing. I mean, what do I wrong? Somebody some it said putting themselves in danger. And you see how the hostage card, you know, let I'm not I'm about to get out of this tap at it. Just pray for this person. Pray, that, pray for this person. If you know who this person is, maybe you guys need to reach out to this person. Um, you know, you don't want to buy it up, you know, harm themselves or anything like that. You know, um, there's a lot of ways to help a person. You know, even, even if you chose not to be with a person, you know, pray for this person, you know. Um, yeah. Okay. I love you guys so very much. Until we get up next time. Later, Sunseeds.